Very good morning, children. Yes, good morning. How are you all? Good. Yes. Then let us see the date today. Yes. Today's date is thirty. Yeah, the month of May. That is August. Here is two thousand twenty-one. Today is Monday. You have English, right? Yes. Then let us see what is the talk for the day. Learn from yesterday. Leave for today and hope for tomorrow. This is the talk for the day. Yes. We are in module two, right? Yes. Take out your workbook. Take out your English workbook part one. Yes. We completed till where? Do you know, children? Yes. We completed till page number fourteen. Yes. What are we completed? Grammar, punctuation marks, full stop, comma, question mark, exclamation mark. Yes. This all we completed, right, children? Yes. Do you remember? Full stop. We should. We will end the sentence. Comma. We will separate the three or more words in list. Okay. Then also we will uh, for the person also we will use the comma. Yes, when we are saying like Sandhi, please come here like that, right? That we need to give comma. Okay. What is question mark? Question mark is we are ending the question. Yes, with the question mark. Okay. Then exclamation mark. What is exclamation mark? Okay. When we are expressing strong feelings such as joy, anger. Then uh, what pain, excitement, sadness, surprise, right? You like that, right? For that, and all we need to give exclamation mark. Yes, yes, we learn this and all, right, children? Yes. Then what we learn? Then we learn apostrophe for singular possession. Yes. What is apostrophe? Like one comma, like like this. Wait, I will show you. Yes, this is an apostrophe. Yes, children? Yes. Like we are adding yes, yes of course, Tuffy. It is used to show something belongs to someone. Okay, that is possession. Okay, the most common way to show belonging to add yes. We are adding yes for the course, Tuffy. Okay, for singular noun only for the singular noun we are using this. Okay, not for plural. Okay, example like Rita's new shoe, uh, Fritz's house. Then Ali's guitar like that. Okay. Yes. This and all we learned in previous class, right? Then we learned contractions also. What is that contraction, children? Contraction. We are shorten the words. We are shorting the words. Okay. Example like we will. Okay. For this we will shorten how W then W E then apostrophe L L. Sorry, I read. That will become breathing. Okay, this is the full form, but short form we will write like this. Okay, this is called contraction. Yes, you know. Yes, this is all we learned in previous class, right? Yes. Today we will learn the role of apostrophe in contractions. Okay, contractions are used to apostrophe in the place of missing letters in a word. Yes, missing letters in a word. How that letter is missing? Yes, see, contraction use the apostrophe in a place of missing letter in in a word. In a word, one letter we are missing. Okay, how we are missing? See how? See in page number fifteen. Yes, children, in page number fifteen, workbook page number fifteen open. Yes, here we have how he is right. Then they have given arrow mark. Then how? Then what they have done? They have cancelled I. Correct. Yes. Then they have given instead of I. What they have given? Apostrophe. They have given this. Right. Yes. This they have given apostrophe. Then what becomes it? What it becomes? House. Okay. House. See example. I will show you here. How is? Then they have given our arrow mark. Then how? Okay. Then. I S E. Okay, in the switch they have cancelled I. The letter they have cancelled. Then here they have given apostrophe. Yes, this is apostrophe, right? So they have given this. Then what it becomes? Now it becomes house. House apostrophe. Okay, understanding children? Yes, like this. Hope so you are getting right. Right. Because I we are cancelled. Okay. Then 
Let us look at some more construction that formed by replacing letters with the apostrophe. Let us see. Construction with is, am and are. Then the I in, in is and the A in or are placed by the apostrophe. Okay. The I, A. Sorry, the A. Okay. In am is replaced by the apostrophe. Okay. Example like this picture, I will show you. Listen carefully. I am. This is I am, right? Then how you will write it in a short form in a construction? Tell me. Using apostrophe C, I, M, M. Okay. I am. Okay, like this in a short form you will write it. For I am. Okay. Then next you can see. She is. Then how you will write? She. Apostrophe S. Yes. She is. Okay, like this. Then one more example, shall I show? He is. Then how you will write? He. Apostrophe S. Yes. This is apostrophe. Okay, understanding this is apostrophe. Then you are giving S. Yes. Then what it becomes? He is. He is. Instead of he is, you are writing is. Understand? It's like this you need to write. Okay, in a short form. This is a shortened way. Okay, this word is written in a short way. That is called a role of apostrophe in constructions. Okay, these are the constructions. What are these are? Constructions. Okay, understand children? Yes, then next. Even one more example I can give. See, I will. Okay. Instead of I will, how you will write I apostrophe L L I will. Okay. You are short. You remove W and I there. How here it is I removed like that only. Here W and I is removed. Then it, it becomes I. I. How you pronounce I. Okay. Then next we have. How you will write we have. Tell me, V. This you are writing, then apostrophe, V, E. Okay, you are removing H and A. Okay, H and A is removed like this. Okay, then apostrophe come, then V, E. We have, we have only pronouncing. But here, while writing, we will shorten it. Understand, shortly we are writing. Understand, children? Then next we have, Construction with not. Okay. The O is not in a replaced by apostrophe. Except for will not. Example like is not. Okay. I write here. Is not. Is not. How you will write? How you will write? Tell me. Isn't. Okay. I S is N T. Because O is not.
The first of it is not used for possessive pronouns such as mine, ours, theirs, his, hers, and yours. Okay, for this we are not uh, the prop, uh, the first of is not used for possessive pronouns. Possessive pronouns so we are not using. Okay, <clears throat> see correct usage are that in page number sixteen you can see here there is an Correct usage. How to use this apostrophe correct way. Okay. Correct usage is mine, ours, yours. Okay. Incorrect is see for for mine you are using apostrophe and s means it is wrong. You should not use for these words apostrophe s. Okay. Ours also, yours also. Okay. This is not a correct way. See incorrect usage. Okay. Then next correct usage is his, hers. It's theirs. For this and all, no need to separate. Short and we need, no need to do. Okay, because these are the pronouns. These are the pronouns for that we should not use apostrophes. Okay, see, is apostrophe s yes, that is wrong. Then hers apostrophe s yes, it is wrong. It's apostrophe it is wrong. Theirs it is also wrong. Okay, if it is like this, no need to write in a apostrophe way. Okay, these are all pronouns, right? That's why. Yes, children. Then next we have exercise three point three. Match the words with correct constructions. One is done for you. Yes. Take out your pencil and do now only, children. Take out pencil. See column A, column B. Column A we have does not, doesn't. Okay. In a what what construction we are uh, doing? Yes. D O S E N O T. In this we will remove O. Correct. Just now I explained. Yes, children. Yes. So does not is nothing but doesn't. Okay. Then next we will we will here W we are removing. I already showed you on the board, right? We will we are removing W. Then it will become we will we will. Okay. Like this. Then match second one for the last one. Then they are. They are how you will uh, for how you will give a construction children that they ye you are removing ye you are removing then they are e okay second one is for e match it finish then next we have we have this also I already showed you on the board we h a we are leaving h a we are removing. Then B have where it is C here B okay fourth one is for B match it then Y is Y is boys I you are removing yes you are putting C in D A okay fifth one is for A fifth one match it for A then last one will not will not won't okay so match it for D. Done children? Yes. Then turn next page. Then here what we have? Differences between possessive and constructions. What are the differences between possessive and constructions? Let us see. See here. Paint brush that belongs to the student. The cover that belongs to the book. Yes. Whatever it is belonging to you. That comes under the possessive construction. Okay. You have learned about using the apostrophe to show singular possession of nouns, singular procession of nouns, singular nouns and all you are giving a, what you are giving? You are giving apostrophe. Okay, that is a singular possession of noun. Okay, a possessive noun, a possessive noun will tell us who or what. Okay, wants have something, which you are having something. If you are having one chocolate, Yes, you are having a dairy milk. Okay, that belongs to you only, right? Then how you will try, how you will tell? The chocolate belongs to Yesh. Like that. Okay, because you are telling about that person's what it belongs. Yes, yes, sir. You will write yes. Okay. Then apostrophe yes. Then yes, chocolate is dairy milk. He is having a dairy milk. Okay, like that you can. That something is belonging to you, right? That is called possessive singular. Okay, possessive noun. Understanding children, example. 
Example, you can see the students, uh, the students' paint brush is on the floor, or a student's box is on the bench. Like that, you can say. So it is belonging to that student, right? So that becomes possessive noun. Okay, which is belonging to somebody else, or it is belonging to yourself. This all comes under the possessive noun. Yes, children. Then the book's cover is colorful. See the book cover, the English book cover is very colorful, right? Yes, the book's cover is colorful. The book's cover is colorful. Okay, this also it is belong to this book only. Okay, a thing also. Okay, let it be a person, thing, animal, anything, let it be. But it is belonging to that, right? So we have to put a first of yes. Okay, that is positive noun. Remember, children, you should remember, not forgetting. Okay. Next, next is construction or words made by combining two words and leaving out one more letters. One or two letters we are leaving in between, right? Like this. We are leaving one or two words in between, right? So these all words are called as constructions. What it is called as constructions. Keep it in your mind. An apostrophe takes place the place of the removed letters. Yes. The, when we are removing one letter, in that place apostrophe we can. Okay. That apostrophe word is called as constructs. Constructions. Understand children? Example you can take. We, we have met the students. Yes. See in page number 17 examples also I am reading. Listen carefully. We have met the students. We have already met the student. Okay. Then the books haven't been covered yet. Yet the books is not covered. Yes, your book should be covered, right? It's not covered, right? So it should be covered like that we are telling. Okay. Haven't means it is not at all. That is have not. Instead of have not, haven't we are using. Understand? These all are construction words which are See, these words are all construction words. Are you understanding? Yes. So, next to turn the page, we have exercise 3.4. Identify whether the given sentence are used to the apostrophe for possessive and constructions. Okay. Write PO for possessive and C for construction. Underline the word that has appropriate in each case. One is done for you. Yes. Here, which is possessive, which is construction, you should underline. And you need to write whether it is a possessive noun or constructions. Okay. Yes. See here, first one I uh, already done for you. Rajus took Yasmin's pencil box. Here, Yasmin's apostrophe is coming. A person, singular, right? So, it is possessive noun. So, P-O-U, they have written. Okay. Then, we are sure it will be rain, rain today. We are, instead of we are, A is removed, correct? They have given apostrophe, right? Then what it becomes, sir? What I told these words are, you can see. What these words I told These are constructions, right? Yes. So you have to write C there. Because here construction is there. Underline that the we are. We are underlined, then write C. Okay. Then second one. There isn't any money left. There isn't, is not. Instead of is not, uh, isn't has come. Then this is which ka, which noun? Possessive noun or constructions? Sir? Which children tell me? Constructions. Because instead of uh, O, we have removed O and we have given apostrophe. Correct? Then this is construct. So write C. Then, the lion's den is in the jungle. Fourth one, the lion's den is in the jungle. Lions, it is an animal, singular. Correct, then what, you should, what noun it is? Possessive noun, write P-O. Okay, underline lions, then write P-O. Okay, fifth one, my cousin's house is nearby. My cousin's, cousin, cousin is a singular noun, right? Then we give an apostrophe. Then which, which noun it is? Possessive noun. Because singular. Correct. So underline cousins. Then writes P-O. Okay. Then next. <clears throat> Last one. Don't feed the animals. 
don't do not instead of do not it is don't then which which it is possessive noun or construction construction so underline don't then write c construction okay then next what we have formal writing we have not writing yes how how we should note that thing we will see notes are used to share short messages what are notes children notes are used to share short messages okay in one or two sentence it will be in one or two sentence read the sample of the note given below to understand its different parts you have to read okay you have to read this sample dear path you did well in the test keep up the good work best wishes mrs asha puli okay so like this the letter is there only in two or three one or two sentence only right so these are the notes okay a small message okay here solution greeting yes dear part dear part is what it is an a solution salutation and greeting we are telling giving some greeting dear or we will use respected okay this and all comes the under the greeting way only okay yes then you how you address the person how you will address dear you are using or respected you are using or lovingly you love with love like that you are using the words right that all is a greeting word okay then it depends on how you are close to them how you are close to them with this letter only we will come to know yes with that sentence only we will come to know dear students my dear students i am morning i will be messaging right very good morning dear students right this all are how close we both are our children and me that we are going to how we are uh, giving a greeting right so that comes under the first letter when you are writing a letter first it comes dear friends or dear parent like that anything dear friend is like that okay then at last you have to put you whenever you write the letter at last you should write the your sign your name you will write right when you are like when you should write a letter at the last of the end you will write best wishes like that you can give anything or thank you you can give or yours sincerely yours faithfully like that then you will write your name here also the same way they have written mrs asha puli like that okay then main subject is called body main what you are trying to tell to them no that is write only the main idea main idea which you are having in your mind mainly what you want to tell to them that you will write it right that is body okay which you are conveying your message to your friend or somebody else okay in this way you will write a note okay then turn next page exercise for your cousin nilima is participating in a inter school boxing championship fill the gaps to complete this note to wish her good luck yes you need to send a good luck you need to fill the lines okay blanks dear nilima it's great to know that you are participating in what they mentioned they mentioned the inter inter school boxing championship so write down the in see the inter school boxing championship the inter school boxing championship write down in that in that blank write down children <coughs> then i am sure you will do very well write down will do very well okay all the best all the best with love see i told you the last with love best wishes like that anything you can add see here also they have add with love sarita see here they have given uh, now not given name you can write your name also no problem okay yes children you can write your name only no problem or you can write this name also no problem okay how you will write see i great uh, it is great to know that you are participating in the inter school boxing championship i am sure you will do very well all the best yes with love sarita like that you will write on letter okay formal writing this is 
Okay, complete it. Yes, then next what we have? Write about a personal experience. Exercise 5. Write about an incident when you or your family helped your neighbors or when your neighbors helped you or your family. Okay, about that you can write them. Scenes also they have given. Write about what happened, who needed help and why. Okay, then how did you uh, or your family help your neighbors or God get help, how you brought the help that you can write. What did you learn from this incident? From this incident what you learned? We should help each other. Yes, when we are in trouble, we need to help each other. That is the humanity. Okay, whenever your friend or anybody neighbors or you don't know that person, then also if he is having some problem, he is facing some problem, if you if you can, if you have a mind to help, you should help. Yes, one day or the other day that person may help you also. Yes, so helping is very very important with our, with our neighbors, family, friends. Yes, we need that helping nature, right? Yes, that should be there, then only we can lead our life happily. Yes, we should help them. So how you will write children the sentence? See page number 19 and 20. How will you write that? Okay, only this, right? Only this page we have, we can complete it. So, I will send this uh, pic for you. You can copy this children. Okay, I will send the pic. I will write it in one book. Uh, I will take a pic and I will send it in the book. That you need to copy in page number 19 and 20. Okay, by the end of the day I will send. Okay, not today's video after only I will send. Not like that. But end of the day at least I will send you. Okay, I will tell you please copy down in page number 19 and 20. Okay, then you should complete. That is your homework. And one more homework, I will send the notes also for you. You should copy in your English notebook. Okay, and you should learn also because your, your FA1 is going to come very soon. So please children, you will try to finish fastly and let us learn. Okay, yes. Today this is enough. We will meet you in the next class. Bye.